Today we tried our brand new pedal tyres on the Traxxas Max. And let you guys know if we think that these pedal tyres are worth the money or are these stock ones just fine for the sand. Beach run coming up. What's up guys, I'm Joe and I'm Amber, we're the, the RC, RC Kiwis. Kiwis. On this channel we do everything from bashing, crawling, speed runs, our box reviews and much more. So if you're new here, consider subscribing, that way you won't miss out on any of our future RC adventures. And lately on the channel we've gone on loads of RC adventures with different shoes on this track smash. Of course we've had it on the stock tyres, but then we went ahead and got these Road Rage Street tyres from Proline. They are so much fun, on road surfaces only, that's what we would say anyway. But then we've gone ahead and got these beastly tyres, <laughs> these things are enormous, these are huge. These are Badland 3.8 belted tyres from Proline, so much fun. At the moment, our funnest tyres on our Max, it really does make a difference. But don't make the same mistake that we did, make sure you change your gearing out. We went stock gearing, the RC lasted about 5 or 10 minutes before that spur gear completely was destroyed. So you probably want to go ahead and get yourself a middle spur gear, the 52 spur gear, and lower your pinion from a 24 to either a 22 or a 22 pinion. At the moment we're running a 52 middle spur gear and a 22 tooth uh, pinion in the Traxxas Max and that's exactly how we're going to be running it today with these Traxxas pedal tyres. Today's mission is to find out whether it's worth going out and buying these pedal tyres or to just to stick with the stock ones. Yeah well because with us we're not, we haven't got any snow out here in Hong Kong. If we did, something is seriously wrong. It must be the day after tomorrow. But just for sand, do you really need to go out and spend $100 on four pedal tires? Or are these stock ones just enough? I know this can also run on water, but we're going to save that for a future video. <laughs> anyway, let's not waste any time. Let's head out to the beach and see how well these tires perform. Here we are at a very beautiful sunny afternoon here in Hong Kong Discovery Bay at the beach. Yeah, okay, it's not that sunny. But it's still, the weather is perfect. Not too hot, not too cold, just right. Anyway, look, here we've got the Traxxas Max with its stock wheels. And we're just gonna, I'm just gonna see how it performs, get a feel for it. And then in a minute, Amber will take for a bit of a speed run along this beach. Hopefully we've still got this spot before it gets too cracked. There's a lot of people around. So this is completely stock. Uh, well, the wheels anyway. Other than the wheels, we have done a lot of upgrades to this Max. But look, it's still beast, man. It's still, Still speeds along the sand. Still a lot of fun. <laughs> Look at the speed of this thing, man. God, I, just, I can never get enough. Every time we bring the Max out, we do get the biggest smile on our face. Now, one thing you want to do before you do take your Max out to the beach is make sure you vent those tires. And by that, I mean put a piece of tape on the inside, cover up the inside hole, and then go ahead and put a couple of holes opposite ends on all four tires so if any little dirt debris water gets inside the tires it should fling out with the centrifugal force but uh man, look at this it's just so much fun it is boosting there are so many people watching there's some kids watching they're loving it they're asking their mum and dad for a Traxxas max for christmas <laughs> cover that kid in sand <laughs> but <laughs> oh wait, look at that that tire i'll tell you what when i created the holes there was a lot of dirt and rubbish inside these wheels already. So they're, they're very out of balance and it would not surprise me if I do explode them today. Let's but hope not. Let's hope not. Before I do, look at, see the front tires sort of wobbling? Before I explode the tires, I'm gonna give Amber the turn to do the speed run. Let me just go ahead and grab that speed run device. All right, we've got the GPS on the max. It is zeroed. We're going for a peak the speed. The GPS, I don't know, it, it, it uses <laughs> GPS. So we'll call it the GPS. <laughs> But let's see what speed you can get, Amber. We're getting some spectators going on here. Amber, the pressure's on. Let's get some good speed going. <laughs> Come on, I can go faster than that. It's coming at me. <laughs> well, watch out, watch out. <laughs> Keep it steady. Keep your eye on the car. <laughs> Alright, bring it in here and we'll see what kind of speed we got going on. 46 kilometers an hour on the speed. I'm gonna have a quick go and see what kind of speed I can get this thing going to. Amber's got 46 kilometers an hour out of this beast, the stock wheels. I'm gonna have a quick run, see if I can beat it before we go and put those pedal tires on. Oh, 
I couldn't get full speed, I was gonna crash into you. There we go, that's full speed. Woo -hoo -hoo. Let's see what kind of speed we got on this Max. Starting to get a bit packed to the beast, so we've got to put our masks on. Anyway, time to get the pedal tires on this beast and see if we can beat 56 kilometers an hour. I'm sure we're going to. The pedal tires are on this beast. Let's take it out on the sand and see how well it performs and get a speed run, speed test for you guys. <laughs> this thing just looks like an absolute beast. So much better with those massive tires. And I can tell you right now, this thing is just <laughs> gonna destroy the sand. Like it's nothing, nothing, not full speed, just gonna feel for it. I would love to take it across the water, but I can't be bothered dealing with screwed up bearings again. <laughs> oh, look at that, look at that wheelie. Oh, <laughs> that was the best I've ever done in my life. On the sand as well. <laughs> it loves to wheelie with these paddle tires, I tell you that. It's starting to get a little bit busy where we were, so we've just changed the spot. Still on the beach here, and uh, we've got the Speedo on the max with the paddle tires. It has been zeroed. Let's see how fast this is going. I'm sure it's going to be 56 kilometers an hour, but by how much? <laughs> now, I'm going to try and keep it in the softer stuff. I know, I know some of you guys are going to be saying, oh, but Joe, you're in the, the tough sand. I'm going to stay on the soft stuff as best I can, and let's see what kind of speed we can get. It does love to wheel it. I don't want to run over those kids watching, and there is some holes over here. There we go, full power. That's full power. Let's see what speed we've got. What do you reckon, Amber? I reckon... I reckon about 60. No, no, 53. We're gonna have to do it again. And if, it, if we can't beat it this time, I'm gonna change the battery. Whoa, yeah, I'm gonna change the battery. I think it's getting a bit weak there. All right, new battery is in. Let's see if we can beat 53. Of course, it should beat it. We're using those Spectrum batteries. The smart technology because we smart. <laughs> 100C as well. Oh, the water's coming in. Let's go. Now that is full power there, guys. Watch out, oh, wheelie. Oh, the water. Oh, I don't know, Ian, but I, you know what? I'm starting to think that those little wheels might have been faster. Let's take a look. 55, it's the same speed. The same speed. All right, watch out, Amber might crash. <laughs> Let's see what Sam has got. Oh, nice wheelie. Thought it was less than 55. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh, what did I just watch? Straight into the tire. But of course, it is still in one piece. Well, guys, we're going to finish off this battery here and take it home and give you guys our initial thoughts on these pedal tires and let you know whether we think they're worth the money. Well guys, we're back at home and man, there was a bunch of fun out there on the beach with the Traxxas Max. Now, let's just revise those speeds. So completely stock, out of the box, with these stock tires on pavement, this RC got to 82 kilometers an hour. And when we put this truck on the sand, it got to 56 kilometers an hour with the stock tires. However, with the pinion on a 22 tooth instead of 24 tooth. Now with the pedal tires, we got it up to 55 kilometers, which is actually slower. Surprised me and a surprise them, yeah. but I honestly did think this was gonna go faster with these pedal tires, but it's slightly slower. It looks very fast as well. It, it did look <laughs> fast. In fact, you know what? It's basically the same speed, 55, 56, mm -hmm. whatever that is in miles power, um, I would have had that on the screen. So Joe, is it worth going out and spending $100 on these pedal tires? Well, the answer is it depends. Now, if you're planning on running this RC on the sand all the time, going up some sand dunes, going on the snow, maybe even going on water, then absolutely these tires are the tires for you. But if you're just like us and you run it on the sand every now and then, then the stock tires are absolutely adequate for that. Just make sure you vent them properly, cover up that hole on the inside and put a hole on the outside of your stock tires. Now, that's gonna save you $100 and there are a lot of things you can do to your Max with $100 and we did create a top five upgrades that you can do to your Traxxas Max. Some of those upgrades are free, 
some of them cost a little bit of money. So if you haven't seen that video, make sure you go check it out afterwards. I will leave a link in the description below and put it in the YouTube card. I definitely agree with you there, Joe. And I would really love to see this on the water someday. How about you guys? And let us know in the comments down below what tyres do you want to see next? on our Traxxas Max. Now in order to not miss any future videos that we do on this beast or any other beast that we have, make sure you go and you hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and if you didn't, give it a like anyway. Make sure you're staying safe out there on your RC adventures. And remember guys, we're the RC Kiwis and we'll see you guys next time. Peace out. All I need is a drum with the heavy beat Hit me with that future sound It's time to let go We're not going home this feeling I can't live without It's a shame on me I'm a fool for the melody This is our party And this is